Hey guys, well I'm out in the shop today and still working on a few little improvements uh, to the G0602. Not only is this helping me improve the uh, machine, but it also helps me learn uh, how the machine works and uh, G code helps me out with learning the different G code commands. Uh, the lathe is a little bit different than the mill, so these little small projects just kind of help you work it, uh, work through all the issues and, and solving problems between uh, generating code through, uh, say, Fusion 360 or writing the code by hand. Today, we're going to be working on this right here. They put a little M6 by 1.0 screw in here. It's about an inch long. And I thought, well, why not have a nice thumb screw? So today, that's what we're gonna work on. So I drew this up earlier in Fusion 360. So let's take a look at that. Okay, so here I am in Fusion 360. And you can see I have my thumb screw drawn. Now this is a great little project because it combines a lot of the operations that you're going to be using on the CNC in just about every project you do. Uh, we have a facing operation, a rough profiling operation, we'll have a finished profiling operation, we're going to have a threading operation and also a parting operation. So it's a great project to kind of get you familiar with your CNC lathe and brush up on some of the uh, different aspects that a CNC lathe has versus a mill. Uh, I know it's beneficial for me and hopefully it'll be beneficial for other people as well. So now that we've got the part drawn up, let's see how we have it machined. So if you go up to Model, Cam, you can see I have all my machining operations here. And let me see if I can get it or in the right orientation here. And so this is our stock, and you can see I've left a little bit on the front side. And let's just run through the program, and we'll simulate it. So we have our parting and then our roughing. And to finish out these little corners in the center there, we've got our finishing with another tool. And then our threading. And because I'm new to threading on the lathe, I put in, purposely put in some extra spring passes just to make sure the threads were cleaned up. And that's pretty much it. So there you have the thumb screw for the pulley cover for the G0602. So let's see how we made it. Let's go ahead and run the part. I've got a piece of three-quarter inch brass stock here. Uh, this will be the first time I'm turning brass, so we'll have to see how that's going to work out. Cycle start.
Went to my small mini lathe and took the nip off the end there and uh, sanded the uh, top. Now you could uh, knurl this if you wanted to or take a file and put some notches in it. But I kind of like it just like this. Uh, it turned out good. Now let's see if it uh, fits. This is M6. By 1.0. Thread. Turned out pretty good. I don't know if you can see this on camera or not. Uh, I left a little shoulder here. But it's probably not necessary for this washer anymore. Well, there you go.
I think it should have been a thumb screw all along and that'll be easier to get your uh, door open with the uh, fun little project and it really helps to get you to learn the machine so there you have it a nice little thumb screw for your G0602 a fun simple project to kind of get you familiar with your machine so thanks for watching the videos please subscribe to the YouTube channel thanks for watching and most importantly be safe